Hey Chikami everybody, this is Miyaku. I'm back with part 64 of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Sly has that ice cream hat on his head. I gave it to him earlier today. I was checking turnip prices and it's a disaster because they went down all week. So I'm going to lose over half of the money I invested on him. It's a good thing I didn't spend my whole life savings on turnips. Just half of it. <laughs> so I lost a quarter of my, my earnings. Hey, I'm an acorn. You're quick today. You're in a Smash Brothers tournament. That sounds cool. Let's see. So let's check my mail first. And then we'll go sell my turnips for a loss. Because I don't want to lose everything. Ship gave me a gift. I had the most amazing dream the other night. You and I co-owned a very hip housewares boutique and business was booming. That This was our best-selling item. Should we make this dream a reality? What is it? Oh, I'm an acorn asks how much I lost. I think I invested 300,000 bells. So I'm probably going to lose like 170,000 bells on that. Dota Airlines are giving me something, huh? Oh, bell vouchers. Okay. That was from May Day. The prize I received from Rover. Let's see what these things are, actually. A retro radiator? That must have been from Shep. And Rover's briefcase. Oh, very cool. It's like a little travel trunk. <laughs> cool. And the retro radiator. What's it's like a heater, right? Does this have to be placed on a wall? It must have to be placed on a wall. KK Island. Alright, who are you playing, I'm an acorn, in this Smash Brothers tournament? I mean, who are you... You usually use... Um, what's his name? Joker, right? I have tons of music in here. That's exciting. I love Smash Brothers tournaments. Is this like an official Smash Brothers tournament? Or is it the ones that they run periodically online? Okay, let's get some turnips sold. I kind of want to see what this radiator is like. Oh, yep, it's a little heater. A brine shrimp aquarium. I think I already have one of those. Oh, you use Inkling. Very cool. Very cool, Acorn. I like Inkling. Should we put on my Explorer shirt that I got today? There's other stuff I need to sell or donate to Blathers, so I will keep it in my pocket. Elegant hat. Okay, let's get rid of these turnips. It's so sad. Today was kind of a long day. I've been out doing yard work again, trying to get my yard in some sort of presentable shape. Oh, I didn't want to pick up the rug. Hello, Blue Bella. Welcome back to the stream. Good to see you. Oh, hey. I wanted to ask you what your price for turnips are, unless your sh turnip shop is closed right now. Because I'm about to lose my shirt on turnips. <laughs> uh... 
I'm an acorn says it's an official non-sponsored just come out and play tourney. You win a chance to join some group. Oh, cool. I've always wanted to do something like that. I've, I've always wondered how far I could get in a real tournament, you know? I'm not the best, but I love Smash Brothers a lot. And I'm not super bad. I wonder if I got any more star pieces. I really, really did well for star pieces. Hello, Pom Pom. I'm so happy to have a way up to the cliffs. I can go check out the scenery anytime. I'm definitely going to do a photo shoot up there. I just learned something. My brother told me that if you have somebody come to your campsite, that you can talk to them. And if you talk to them enough, even if your island is full, they will move in and kick out a random villager. And I'm really sad that I didn't do that for Phil, because I would have loved to have Phil move into my island. Ooh, that was a close one. Bluebell is on a quest for Raymond. Everyone's on a quest for Raymond. What is it about Raymond? Oh, it's KK. Should I request a song? Tomorrow's the day the folks from Happy Home Academy come to visit. The bugs in the floor always get excited when the Happy Home Academy comes by. I wonder what score I'll get. I'm pretty sure that that Drake has schizophrenia because he hears voices and he says bugs are talking to him. I'm an acorn says Raymond was the first villager to come to your campsite. Did he move into your town? Apparently he's like super highly desired, right? I need to sell turnips. I know, I don't... It's bad to sell them right now, but... I don't have much else to do. I gotta get rid of them so they don't rot. So, Raymond is on your island. I'm an acorn says, I can't show, you know. What do you mean you can't show? Look at that fancy kimono stand. Elaborate come on. Oh, I said fancy. It's elaborate. It looks like it has samurai swords holding it up 220,000 bells. Ah, I have to pass on that one. That's too rich for my blood. I Am interested in this clay furnace. This is cool 3,000. That's more like it This will make a good outdoor restaurant type area A pull-up bar stand sure sure we can make a muscle beach. I'll do that Oh, you just can't show me right now because you're in the Smash tournament. Well, yeah, that's fine. A fortune teller set? That will go fantastically with my rug. A thousand bells. Yeah, let's buy it. I already have a microscope, so I don't need that. I realized I didn't... I took my pants off again. I do that a lot. I don't mean to do it. What did I come in here to buy? I came in here to buy something. Oh. I remember. It was these. These customization kits. I didn't mean to buy one. I wanted to buy in bulk. I wonder if I can make villagers move out. If I give them trash. Do you think they'll move out if I give them a lot of trash? I really wish this would let me select more than five at a time. Why can't I pick like a 30 at a time? Anyways, we we got our little flower bed cleaned up a little bit more and I'm gonna plant, we planted some peas in it. So hopefully we get some good peas growing. And we also are gonna plant some pumpkins and watermelons. Oh, I'm an acorn. You just lost your first game? That's too bad. Yay! 
Yeah, peas, green peas. We're we're growing garden uh, garden stuff. Vegetables, you know. Oh, this is really the only thing you need is a pond skater? Okay then. A pond skater, what a wretched thing. Yes, let's tell me more about this one. In that case, I am putrid pond skaters. They walk on water, you know, which is most preposterous. It is a trick they perform by secreting oil onto the hairs of their feet, to which I say blech. And one must wonder, what will they do next? Walk on air? Walk through walls? Perish the thought. He's quivering. I love it when he does that. Anywho, my sincerest thanks. Whoa, holy cow, that's a scorpion. That scared me. Is it like a tarantula? It is like a tarantula. This seems way more dangerous than a tarantula. I don't know if I want to catch this. Holy crap. Holy crap. It's a showdown. Oh, look, it's so scary. Yeah. Did I get it? Oh, whew, that was close. Ooh, look at it. Oh, it's so creepy. Oh, get that out of here. And there's a little red stinger. Oh, red stinger of death. What does it look like? Ew, ew, put it back, put it back. Hey, Bon Bon, do you like this thing? Do you like this? Oh, she does like it. I thought she'd be grossed out by it. Never mind. Ooh, that's horrifying. Oh. Blather, that's why Blathers and I get along. I hate bugs, too. I got soul, but I'm not a soldier. A scorpion, what a wretched thing. Would you like to learn more? Please tell me. I see. A scorpion, how should I put this? Those legs, those pincers, that tail, and that venomous stinger. It's as if someone took all the most awful insect parts and put them together to make the scorpion. I totally agree with him. All scorpions are venomous, you know. Though I understand that only a few kinds are truly deadly. I fear I might just die thinking about it. Any hoot. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Blathers. You, sir, are a scholar and a gentleman. He takes good care of things that he despises utterly. Guess I will put these into my storage and sell them on a day when the guy is here that likes to buy that stuff. Oh, that's a big fish. Is it a sea bass? It's probably a sea bass. Feels like a sea bass. Ah, of course it is. Get out of here. Let's put the pull-up bar right here, just to get it out of my pocket. Oh, not that. I think I might put that in my house. There you go. Now you can do pull-ups on the beach. Have I got a clay furnace? Oh, that was a new bug too. Nuts. I scared it away. Oh, hi, Tammy. It's been a while. I like your shirt. I guess Tammy's taking it easy right now. Let's put the clay furnace out here. Just 
just for now. This looks like the little furnace that's in the town in Breath of the Wild. I don't remember the name of the town, but the one you have to dress up like a girl to go into. I'm an acorn's going up against Isabel right now. Your arch nemesis? I love Isabel. Hey, what's up, McDuffie? Welcome to the stream. Good to see you again. I am just um, losing lots of money on turnips right now because they're going to spoil and they're only worth 40 something bells on my island. This was a bad week for me because they never went up. I bought them at 110 and they sunk all week long. Never went any higher than that. But I got to cut my losses and at least get some bells back out of it. Oh, I didn't want to take that. Okay, what can I put in my storage that I've got? Oh, the bell vouchers. I should have... I should have sold those while I was there. The coconuts I'll put into storage, I guess. I don't need them. I was going to plant them, but... I'll use them to make something later. <laughs> Blue Belly, you're going to try and find me a good deal on Turnip Exchange? That's alright. I'm not going to go to all the trouble to, to game the system and find a stranger and sell my turnips. I kind of like to play... I kind of like to play riskily. It sort of spoils the fun if you always make money on the turnips. Otherwise it wouldn't even be exciting to do it. Oh, customization. Uh, it reminds me, I was going to try and customize my vending machines. Yeah, 44 bells per turnip. That's so terrible. I need my money back. It's better than losing it all. Oh, that was so much money. pocket and customize them real quick. See what I can do to them. We'll make them look a little more interesting, maybe. Oh, not craft. Customize. Customize. No? I can only customize the drink machine? Orange juice. Sports drink. Sale. Cute. Or whatever I want, I guess. Should we make it a Mr. Saturn drink dispenser? No cats. <laughs> I'll put Mr. Saturn on there. Sure. Nah, no, no, no. I'll just leave it the way it is. I don't really need to do that. And it uses a lot of the money, or a lot of the customization kits. My brother has a pink one. His drink machine is pink, and his vending machine is black. That's why I thought I could customize it. Well, that is not what I wanted it to look like. Yeah, prices are low today. It's a bad day for turnips everywhere, isn't it? The stock market crashed.
Maybe I'll listen to a KK song to ease my troubled mind. At least my fruits can bring me some profits. I need to change my fruit farm. I don't really like the layout of it here. It's way too crowded. Was my radio playing KK Condor? Because Blue Bella just said KK Condor. I'm surprised. People seem to be able to recognize the songs in this. There's, I cannot do that. I don't know them well enough. Most of my fruit farm picked up here. These flowers don't seem to be reproducing. Maybe, do they have to have another flower next to them to reproduce? I also don't have a shovel, do I? I've got to get a shovel somehow. I guess I'll buy one next time I'm in the Nook Boy shop. McDuffie can stay for 22 minutes. You're welcome to stay for as long or as short as you would like to. There's no pressure here on the stream. This is just supposed to be a place to relax and chill and have fun. Now I've got another guitar somewhere. I have a bass guitar and a cello. I should make a music room sooner or later. You want me to play KK Condor? I have no I know I have it. Where is it? It's like Peru. It's those Mezca line, Nazca lines, whatever they're called. There we go. KK Condor, just for you, Blue Bella. Oh. McDuffie says it's way too late to stay up to 3. It's not even 10 o'clock where I'm at, so I agree. Staying up till 3 is way too late. Let's go make my final sale. Hey, Tammy changed her shirt. And I'll buy a shovel while I'm here. Oh, hello, Dell. I sort of wish that I could get him to move out because I have two alligators on my island. What's on my mind? I have something to give you, Dell. I sure do. It is a... A flower. A yellow mum. How do you want that? Ah, it's 11.40. I usually stream for like an hour and a half, yeah. That's right, McDuffie. Sometimes that's how long it takes to relax. Plus, I figure... If I've been working hard all day long, I don't feel too guilty about killing an hour or two on this. Venus comb. I was saving those to craft with, so I'll keep, I think I'll keep that. 36,000 bells. Okay. Let's buy a shovel. Sorry guys. I'm an acorns in the finals for his Smash tournament. Not bad. Not bad. 
Okay, I sort of want to listen to a song. Should we have him do KK Condor? He said he would take requests, right? Uh, are you in the mood for a song tonight? Let's hear it. What requests? I can dial up an old favorite, or you can just tell me how you're feeling and I'll groove on it. Um, give me that one song. Oh wow, do I just write it here? This seems like you, this is like a secret code area. I bet you can put in secret codes here and different things will happen. And only Nintendo Treehouse knows what codes to put in here. So like, could I put in Legend of Zelda and he would play Zelda or Mario or something like that? KK Condor. Is it working, Blue Bella? Is this KK Condor? Is this KK Condor? I don't know. I'm, I think, I take it it's not because she just said oof. Or they just said oof, I mean. <laughs> you don't know what it is. I don't know either, but it's awesome. I'm really feeling it. My little duck is really feeling it too. Drake. Drake is feeling it. Jaden Reddy says, I need help. What do you need help with? Is it turnip prices? Because I needed help with that too, and I just lost my shirt. <laughs> Splatoon has consumed your life. That's why you need help, Jaden. It's a good game. It's so good. I stayed up, I actually, so I was streaming last night, and then right at the end, I got the urge to play Splatoon, and then I stayed up for like another hour. I think it was only an extra hour playing Splatoon. I felt a little bad, because I was doing Turf War, and it must be that there's demo right now, because everybody was level one or two, so I was totally flexing all over him. Bluebella asked if I've chose my team. Yes, I chose key Team Ketchup. Why would I ever choose Team Mayo? That's horrible. Oh, thanks, McDuffie. Don't feel bad for an hour of relaxing. Oh, you, you came in second in a Rocket League tournament? Not bad. Yeah, team catch-up all the way. Cool, Daddy-O. Thank you. Did that hit your ears just right? Just right, KK. That hit my ears just right. Well, I've got a confession. I didn't know the song you wanted, so I pulled one out of my back catalog. That was, like, unreal. Thanks for turning your dial in my direction. I wonder if I could get him to play a different song, like Gerudo Valley. Do you think he would play Gerudo Valley? Should I try it? I'm gonna try it. Give me that one song. Okay, I'm gonna put it in exactly. What if this works? This would be amazing. I don't know any other songs. Somebody told me to play Megalovania. I did listen to it. It's actually really awesome. Do you think KK would play Megalovania if we ask him to? Okay, he said he's gonna play it. He said groovy anyways. He didn't say he's gonna play it. This one's called Gerudo Valley. Come on, play the real thing. This would be amazing. This is not Gerudo Valley. Me, 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 me. 
<laughs> but I like it. This is actually very, very relaxing to me to listen to these songs for some reason. This game does exactly what I need it to do. Gerudo Valley is a... it's an area in Ocarina of Time, and it has the best Zelda song in it. I have a feeling that there are codes that you can put in here and he will do special things if you know the codes. I'm not gonna lie, I could listen to him sing songs probably for a couple hours just doing that. Cool, daddy -o, thank you. Did that hit your ears right? Sure did. That's alright, buddy. You can play whatever song you want, whenever you want to. I almost have all of these DIY recipes. I've been trying to clean them out. I don't know if it's going to do anything if I clean them out, but... I want them all the same. Blue Bella says, wait, can I see them all? Can you see all of what? All of the things in this area? Like this Nook Mile shopping area? The, these things? Is this what you want to see? That's a cool lighthouse. I've never bought one. I've never thought about buying one, but I should. Well, that's it, I think. Yeah, that's it. I should get one of those lighthouses. I just spent all my money, so I can't do it now. But I will eventually. Can I ask KK to play Animal City? Sure thing, McDuffie. I would love to do that. Yeah, the black and white lighthouse looks really nice, I agree. Animal City, so is that how I... I've got to put it in exactly like that, right? Hit me with that deep cut, what's it called? Well, I hear it's called Animal City. That would be pretty sweet if we could get him to play other stuff, like... oh, Like Megalovania, apparently. Animal City. 
Hey, look who's plugged into the code machine. How do you know my secret song? Oh, it is the code. So McDuffie knows there's secret. I knew there would be secret codes on here. Take a seat and get ready for Animal City. All right. I'm going to sit by Bonbon bon this time. Hey, what's up, Toast? I'm excited. I've never heard this song before. I love how he howls at the end of the songs. Howl. That's so relaxing. I love listening to these songs. Kiki's the man. Alright. I was gonna go... I haven't dug stuff up yet. That's what I was gonna do, actually. I should learn these things and get them out of my pocket. Hey, Ozzy. Welcome back. Dr. Scrunch, welcome back. Good to see both of you. Hey, he gave me the animal song. The Animal City song. No way. Does anyone want Tia? Bluebella is offering Tia. I don't know who Tia is. I should make I should make a lost home for ugly island uh, ugly villagers on my island. Cause my brother has one that he doesn't like. Oh, this is so cool, you get that secret song. Yeah, my brother has one called um It's a frog. Diva? It's a frog with horrible eyes. He wants to get rid of her. And then I heard about Wart Jr. I sort of want to make the island for misfit toys here on my island. Oh, let's catch this fish. Oops. <laughs> Everybody wants Raymond. It's like the show, everybody loves Raymond.
Is this another sea bass? What kind of animal is Tia, Bluebella? Oh, it's a flounder. Flounders are not bad. They're not what I'm hoping for, but they're not bad. What's up, Jacob? Hey, Backbeat, thanks for saying hi. I wanna chat. The sky today looks clear and dry, but that means the sun and moon are happy. Sure thing, pal. Do you want this? I am giving you. What am I giving you? Not money, that's for sure. A. I guess I'm giving you a fish. How about that? Tia's an elephant? All of Flounder is so num num nummy. <laughs> he loves to eat the fish. Here, man, it's a raincoat. Enjoy, you feel? I was hoping I would get some more stars tonight, but I guess maybe my stars already have all been found today. This would be a good place for a fortune-telling kit, wouldn't it? Let's put the fortune-telling kit here. There we go. There's some incense and a fortune-telling kit. Okay, secret songs are Animal City and Drive-In Farewell. So I guess I should go have him play Drive-In Farewell before he leaves. That way I can get that secret song too. Remind me when I'm next over to KK and I will do that. Ozzy wants to visit Cherry. You want to visit Cherry? She's so evil. I'm going to give her trash. I'm going to give her trash until she moves out. Oh, a little clownfish. Look how cute they are. They're so cute. Oh, what did I do? Oh, that's the wrong thing. Dope. Be shellfish? A shifty shellector. Cast master. Oh. Did I actually do it? I never thought I was going to do that. You'll need to nab a bunch of fish in a row without a single one getting away to earn these miles? Did I really get 50 in a row? No way. Cast master. Sweet! There's a present somewhere. Where is it? Ah, oh, there it is. I'm an acorn says you need to not talk to your villager to make them move. Oh, so giving them garbage? I thought giving them garbage would insult her so much that she would move because they hate it when you give them garbage. I tried to give somebody garbage once and they were like, ooh, I don't want this. Take it back. And they wouldn't take it. I think it was Shep. I gave Shep some garbage, and he was like, nope, not taking it. What's up, Pom Pom? You like my Glam Explorer shirt? Maybe you'll buy something like that when you try to practice dancing or think about going jogging. Uh, what's the latest? Lately, you've been missing Zavadar. I hope they're having fun on Zafiro, but you wish they were here instead. Okay. So from here on out, I'm no longer talking to Cherry. We'll see if we can get her to move out.
Wait, something about Driven. Driven has A and Farewell a different song? <laughs> poor Cherry, Ozzy says poor Cherry. Cherry killed people. Remember there are graves behind her house. At least that's what I think happened. I don't know how what else they're doing there. I'll go show you Cherry sometime, Dr. Scrunch. I'll be up to her place pretty soon. I don't actually have anything against Cherry. I just have I have two bear cubs and two alligators and two ducks. So my island is really lacking in diversity. I like Celia. She's nice. She has a nice, sweet personality. I think I will give her a raincoat. Oh, now you look like a detective, kind of. Oh, there's something to dig up here. Oh, I need to upgrade this shovel before I break it. Should I shake some trees? See if I can get some furniture out of it? Maybe it's in this tree. Nope. Nothing. Wait a minute. Somebody said they don't like that bird. Who said that? I'm an acorn. You don't you don't like Celia? She's so polite though. She doesn't strike me as evil at all. Oh, there we go. There's the furniture. What is it? A coffee cup? Very cool. Very cool. Let's put this... Let's fix my shovel before I break it. Centipedes are so creepy. Oh, look, I got some new purple flowers there. And I got some red flowers. Nice. My mums are spreading. Stegoceratops. My Tristegos my Trisaurus? Tristegosaurus? I don't know what the appropriate term for it is.
hit my little clay modeling kit there. It's actually dessert. It looks like dessert, so I put it next to my picnic set. It's clay. Don't tell anybody. They might try to eat it. There's my bathtub. Look at my awesome bull bathtub. He's so golden. I don't know why I put it there. I didn't have anywhere else to put it. Am I gonna get that fish? Probably not. Right there, there we go. Yes, another cherry salmon. I really like those. They're pretty fish. Okay, coming up on Cherry's house. Hers is back in the back there. And this is... This is Bon Bon's house. Bunny. <laughs> Looks like Cherry's probably home, because I haven't seen her around. Yeah, she's home. So we'll go check in on Cherry but I'm not going to talk to her. Oh, she's building something. I have to talk to her. Curse you, Cherry. She just, she knows how to manipulate. Natural garden chair. Yeah, that sounds like I don't have that yet. I do? Oh, why did I talk to her? Ozzy says, does anyone know what small blood cells do? I don't know what you're talking about, small blood cells. Do you mean red blood cells? As far as I know, there isn't a type that's specifically called small blood cells. Cherry is fat. <laughs> I think that's just her body habitus. It's glandular. <laughs> There's Shep hanging out in his new t-shirt that I gave him. I think I would actually rather keep Cherry and get rid of Bonbon bon if I could. Drake and Jacob are both kind of weird. They both talk about hearing voices and stuff. Jacob talks about hearing bugs in the floor, and I think, I think Drake did too, actually. I'm not sure what you mean, Ozzy. You're gonna have to expound a little bit when you say, when you say small blood cells. Are you talking about red blood cells or different ones? Red blood cells are probably the smallest blood cells. All of your blood cells are smaller than normal. Oh, so you've had a blood smear done? Ah, I can't pick up any more pansies. Guess I just can't pick up blue pansies. Oh, I already left some garbage over here and forgot to pick it up. I'm so trashy sometimes. Smaller than other people. You were born with it. Hmm. 
So are you talking about something called hereditary spherocytosis? Or something else entirely? Bluebell is willing to give up Raymond because of the small blood cells. I'm still, I still want to know what it is. Um, so he's not actually talking about a small blood cell as a type of cell. His production of blood cells apparently is a little bit um, off, but I'm not sure in which way yet. I'm suspicious that he means hereditary spherocytosis, but I'm not sure. Let's drop the sticks. Because I can come back to this area and pick up this stuff. Oh, weeds. We'll drop it again. I got a lot of stuff to pick up. Oh, why did I pick that up? Oh, you didn't have enough white blood cells as a kid, but then you don't know what the doctor did, but you have more now, says Jaden. Oh, Ozzy doesn't have syrup. Oh, wait, no, I'm getting confused. Jaden was not the one talking about white small cells. Ozzy is. Yeah, microcytosis is small, usually refers to small red blood cells. It's often seen with iron deficiency, so you get microcytic anemia. Um, but I'm not exactly sure in which way he's talking about his cells being smaller. That probably is what he's talking about. Ozzy says he can't have children with people who have it, which is most Asian populations. Oh, are you talking about like alpha thalassemia or beta thalassemia? Is that what you're talking about? The freshwater goby. Uh, I think you can go. I probably don't need you. Oh yeah, KK. So let's go have KK sing again. Well, let me empty my pockets a little bit, and then we'll have KK sing. It's called Driving, right? Driving. not worth very much, are they? Okay, so let's do driving. You gonna join us, Jacob, or are you just gonna creep around behind him with your purse? <laughs> you look at his purse. Jacob, you're so weird. Why, what is he doing? Okay, so let's do driving. Yeah, it's an apostrophe. There's an apostrophe at the end of drive-in because it's it's contracted. You cut the G off. K 
Okay, here we go, driving. It's harder for your red blood cells to deliver oxygen. That sounds a lot like you've got alpha thalassemia or beta thalassemia, um, or maybe a hemoglobin H. Maybe you have hemoglobin H. <laughs> what is Jacob's? What is this deal? He's just walking in and out. Sit down or join us or leave, Jacob. He didn't howl at that one. He just made a little huh huh sound. Okay, let's do farewell too, right? One more song? Are you picking up what I'm putting down? How about an encore, daddy Oh Yeah, I'd love that. Cool, cool, any requests? Yep, I got a request. It's called Farewell. Wait a minute, I hear a package. I changed my mind. I have a package first. Where'd it go? I thought I could hear one. I know I can hear one somewhere. There it is, I knew there was one here. Judge's Bell. <gasps> Judge's Bell? Is this from Splatoon? Oh no, it's not. I thought it was Judd's Bell, like the cat collar. <laughs> That's pretty cool. long way to get to that E. <laughs> Ozzy says, can I tell you guys some advice? Sure, hit us with that knowledge, Ozzy. Don't get cooked, stay off the hook. Stay fresh. I like stay fresh better than don't get cooked. Thanks, uh, thanks, Ozzy.
Awesome. Good concerts, KK. Just what I needed. Uh, he's already got all these fossils. <laughs> Ozzy, I'm gonna be AFK for a bit. Three seconds later, I'm back. <laughs> What are these? Ankylo and Kylo Stegoskull. All right. And a Spino Torso, Diplo Tail. Let's me. My brother wanted. My turnip price is 44, Norman. It's terrible. And I just sold like $200,000 bells worth of turnips for that price because that's all I could get. My shop is closed right now, anyways. Diplo Neck and Ophthalmo Body. That's what my brother asked me for. I don't have either of those. But my Stego Skull, I'm going to keep and put it over in my park. Thanks, Norman. I hope you have a good day, too. Thanks for stopping by. Blue Bella, goodbye. I'm an acorn asks, can I come to your island? You got something you want to show me? I was going to reorganize my fruit trees a little bit here. These are all pear trees, I believe. I got too many pear trees, way too many. And it's crowded right here. It's, it's bugging me a little bit. I think right here would be a good spot for it. No, not there. Right there, maybe? No, not there. Maybe... I want it to be kind of in the middle. Can I not go right in the middle? Maybe right here? No, I can't because my trees are too close. I gotta space them a little bit further. So, so I space it exactly the same, okay. There we go, that's better. Then I want one like right here. That's better. Maybe I want one right there. Cherry tree. Oh, those were cherry trees. Oh. All right, I guess I'll eat some peaches. Okay, that's pear. Perfect. Maybe that's still too close. Let's 
Let's move it back one and see how that looks. Maybe I'm being too picky about this. I think that looks better. Okay, that's a nice little inverted kind of symmetry right there. Symmetry, you get it? <laughs> symmetry. That really wasn't that funny. A hardwood tree? Uh, I don't really need a hardwood tree. I'll just put this down, I guess, for now. I can move it later if I want to. sort of out of my... I'm out of my... Oh, there's that bug that I've been trying to catch. I think that's the bug I've been trying to catch. Oh, no. I already have that bug. Another sea bass. These things are so common. Oh, I've been missing the chat here. Bubblegum is good, but it's not a secret, says Mick. Doctor S oh, Dr. Scrunch suggested bubblegum. We should listen to it. Everybody loves bubblegum. It's a pretty cool song. I have it on my stereo. I, I've played it a few times. I like it. Just tidying up my island. I'm looking for some fish food because there's new fish to catch. back up here. Ooh, is that a frog? That looks like it could be a frog. Oh, well, that was a terrible cast. Oh, come here, frog. Oh, it looked the wrong way. Should I just wait? It's gonna turn this direction, isn't it? Or not. There we go. Ah, 
A goldfish. That's new. I don't think I have a goldfish yet. Oh, my pockets are already full. I'm an acorn wants me to visit the island. You have gifts. I guess I could do that. I don't really have anything else going on. I finished all my chores. <laughs> my chores. I'm just tidying up here. Dr. Scrunch also says when will I visit your island? I can do that. Today, I guess, if you want me to. I could go to acorns first and then yours. Since I've finished up here. I could hear another present. I thought I was going crazy at first. How did I miss that? There we go. Oh, I broke my slingshot. Antique boots. What are these? They look like Link boots. Let's see, I'm going to keep most of this stuff for crafting. So I need to go back to my house and dump it. Alright, so... I think... I think I'm already friends with you, Acorn. So you can just open up your island. And I'll go search for open islands. That way you don't have to post your dodo code. Sound good? Okay, join... Oh, we had the same thought. Alright. Hey, wait a minute. Where did that go? Did I just miss it? Oh, it's up here. Okay, let me dump some stuff out of my pocket. Yeah, I'm gonna empty my inventory. Oh, I just heard another... How do you say your name? My name says Mick. It's... So, it's an Albanian word. Mieku, it means the doctor. And you can pretend like the J is a Y. I don't know why I picked it. It seemed like a good idea at the time. So it's Mieku. I explained how to say it, but I don't think I ever did say it. But that's how you do it. Judge's bell. Let's put the bell down here, actually, so that I have a person waiting. They can ring the bell and get the receptionist's attention. <laughs> you thought Mieku was my real name? No, Mieku is not my real name. That's just the name that I picked for myself for some... Because everybody picks like a video game name, right? That was the name I picked. My real name's Jason. And yes, I am. I am a physician. I'm a dermatologist, actually.
Oh, hold on. I gotta put some pants on. I forget that I'm not wearing pants. We'll put these ones on. My comedian's pants. Wait a minute. Where'd they go? I always do that. Or should I put this one on? This looks pretty good. This one comes with pants. There we go. I gotta get dressed up to go to his island. Hold on. I need a nice, a, a nice dapper hat. There we go. And I need my winkle pickers. Where are they? There's my winkle pickers. There we go. Now I'm ready to go visit. Acorn, I'm on my way. I want to go to Nut Island. Oh, I wonder if it's Zabadar. I wonder if he had good prices on his turnips. Here we go. I'm ready for my flight. I'm not even going to take any of my my vertigo medicine. I'm blinking on the name of it for some reason now. It's, I don't need it. But people are Dramamine? Dramamine's just Benadryl. But there's another one that people use. I forget what it's called. Scopolamine? I think Scopolamine is the generic name. I don't remember the brand name. What's Tonight Show? <laughs> it's the Tonight Show. That's what the Tonight Show is. Oh, looks like you're doing the mannequin trick, trying to move your rocks all around. So, The Tonight Show is a TV show, and Jimmy Fallon is the host of it. That's where I got the name for my character and my island. McDuffie says, I'm Falcon because I wall tramp. What is wall tramp? Wow, look at all this brick. How'd you do this? Is this a path? <laughs> His mask. Ooh, what is this? A black rose? Very nice. Very nice. All right. What do you want to show me? Give me the tour. Wow, look at all these flowers. Holy moly. Are those gills? Are those gills on these mannequins? I'm stuck. Here we go. Oh, this must be your house. Look at this nice island. Or, I mean, peninsula. be typing something.
<laughs> I love that reaction. All right, so what are we doing? These are, how many? You must have spent so much time planting flowers. Wow. little waterfall here. Can I fish off the edge of this cliff? Can I fish that far down? I'm curious. You can. All right. Hold on. I got to catch this fish because I want to pull it all the way up the cliff. Come here, fish. I was just curious and you can. So now I have to do it. I got nervous again. Shoot. <laughs> well, so much for that. Chris Collins, popping into my stream. Thanks, Chris. I've seen you here before. I recognize your little picture. Welcome back. an angelfish. Not bad. I like these little guys. I think I got lost. Where did he go? Where did they go, I should say. Look at all these mannequins. This is sort of like a horror movie. It's like that Doctor... That Doctor Who episode where those angel statues come to life. Oh, it was so creepy. It was way too creepy for my blood. Alright, so what else are we gonna do? Show me around. Show me something. McDuffie, why all these mannequins? So apparently there's a trick where if you put mannequins everywhere on your island and then you break your rocks, the, the one place that you've left open, the rocks will show up there the next day so you can sort of rearrange your rocks into particular position that you want them to be in. Totally stuck here. It's like a maze of mannequins. There's a fish. I gotta catch it. Fishing is my favorite for sure. All right, a butterfly fish. This must have taken so long to put all these mannequins around. <laughs> the poor little guys. They can't even go, oh, I want to see who his islanders are. Hey, look, it's this guy, Raymond. Everybody wants Raymond, right? Everybody loves... Oh, he has koalas? I actually think I like the koalas and this angry kangaroo. And a, a cow? I like this deer, too and a big bear. I'm gonna have to go stop by Raymond's house because Ozzy will freak out. Okay, sorry about that, I got distracted. Come here, fish. Oh, it was so close, come on. Turn it just a little bit. Just turn your face just a little bit, fish. So close. Come on. There we go. Alright, 
I got it. McDuffie says, what way, what way do you play and tell me if you use a pro controller? I usually use a pro controller, but I also play with my Joy-Cons disconnected. I use the pro controller more often because the Joy-Cons have drift and it drives me insane. Okay, should we go check out your house? And then I'm go gonna go visit Raymond. I like the wreath on the door. I should make a wreath for my house. Oh, look at all these DIY things. Goodness. Holy cow. How'd you get this awesome crafting bench? Oh, and these sweet deer statues. Look at these. How did you get those? I, I want to make those. That's way cool. Cool walls, very cool. This looks like a studio of some sort. I really, really like these deer, these fake deer mounts. Can you customize them? Oh, your house is way empty. Man, look at all these DIY projects. Are they all duplicates, I take it? All right, I'm gonna go visit Raymond. Oh, wow, I've already been playing for an hour and 36. Do, 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 do. Okay, I'm gonna go visit Raymond. He's crafting, I think he's making those fake deer mounts for me. Those are so cool. All right, Raymond, here I come. Where's Ozzy? Is, did Ozzy, Ozzy left the stream, didn't he? <laughs> he? He's gonna miss Raymond. I gotta catch this frog. I have a feeling it's a frog. It is a frog. All right, I totally called it. Oh, what is, oh, the deer decoration. Thank you so much, Acorn. I love this. I'm gonna put it up in my house forever. Is that a weed? Oh, it's a spoiled turnip, ew. Hello, Raymond. Here we come. Chris Collins likes Audie best. She calls you funky. What villager is Adi? What kind of animal is she? Look at this. Look at this, Ozzy. Do you love it? Guess who this is? Wow, is he like a... Wow, he's like a jewel thief. It's filled with gold bricks. Raymond has gold bricks in his house. There's nothing in here. There's clearly gold bricks in there. <laughs> He's like a scientist. Is he a spy? He's like a spy. Raymond's a spy, isn't he? Are you new here or just visiting from tonight's show? Well, Raymond at your service. If Nut Island were a game show, I'd be the host. So, announcer, tell our contestant what they've won. It's a fabulous island getaway with celebrity guests, including Raymond. Raymond is a cool cat. He has a... He's got a little record player. And... A whiteboard. He's in the office. He, he works in a, look at his office carpet. Looking for me again? Well, you found me, what's up? Oh wow, you changed into the, the typical villager from Smash Brothers. Hey, you know Acorn, right? They live right here on that island, Crisp. Well, here's something you might not have known. They also go by so-called gamer. Crisp, it's almost like they have a secret identity. I gotta get one of those. Audie is a peppy fox. That's what Chris Collins says. Oh, cool. I don't think I've seen Audie. Yeah, I do want to talk to you more. 
So many guests in so little time. I need to hear everyone's take on my new water wing. Oh, I have some wands. What? Acorn, thanks. I have a fish wand and a bamboo wand. And I think somebody gave me a snowflake wand. I don't remember who it was. Well, that was cool. I finally met the fabled Raymond. Oh, what happened here? Is this a garage sale? <laughs> I like this table. Wow. Look at all this. This is crazy. What hap- What is going on here? I'm totally stuck. I gotta see all this. Wow, look at all this stuff. Whoa, a coelacanth. Cool. There's the football fish. Let's turn his light on. You can turn his light on if you click on him. He won't let me do it. Is this not the football fish? Ah, I guess it won't do it. Oh, I got nervous again. Shoot. I get so nervous with these fish. All right. Well, is that the tour? Somebody else wanted me to visit their island. I guess I could do one more tour before I go to bed. It won't let me turn the lights on, period. I know you can turn this fish's light on. Because I had one in my house and I did it. You probably have to move the other stuff, but it won't let you do it when I'm here, I think. Anything else you want to show me, Acorn? A little court? I'm gonna make a little basketball court or a restaurant here or something? A cafe? Oh, you scared that fish away. Thanks for the deer head. I'm super happy about that. This is Bruce. Oh, Bruce is that little deer. I love the little deer villagers. Oh, no way. His house is so sweet. Bruce might be my favorite villager. Look at this guy. Don't think I've seen you around these parts. You a tourist? Hey, yeah, name's Bruce. If you picked the right island to visit, let me tell you. That island's just perfect for these old bones. Well, don't let me stop. You go nose around. Talk to folk and enjoy yourself, gruff. Okay, Bruce might be my favorite villager. He is cool. Mick loves deer. Yeah, I love the deers, too. I guess the plural of deer is actually just deer, not deers. I always say deers. McDuffie, how do you make presets on a wand? You have to go to a closet or a fish cooler. My fish wand, I make the presets from a fish cooler. Hamfrey? Oh yeah, it was Dr. Scrunch. He wanted me to go to his island, or their island, I mean. Oh, look at him, he's a little short. Oh, he look at his eyebrows. Hamfrey, Hamfrey, you're so cool. I love Hamfrey a little bit. <laughs> the music he's got going. I have this recipe, but I cannot make this table. I want to make it. I'm going to dance to this music. There we go. I feel like this is the appropriate way to dance to this music. I like this guy. Hamfrey is pretty cool. Chris Collins' favorite deer is Eric. His house is like the North Pole and his furniture is made of ice. Oh, that sounds way cool. Okay, anything else you want me to see here? Or should I go back to my, go back to my island? I 
kind of want to get rid of my... F I lost him again. Where did he go? I kind of want to get rid of my original two villagers because their houses, they never... They never decorated them. They're still filled with the junk that they moved in with. And all the other villagers have nice houses with themes and stuff. So I kind of want my villagers to all have themed houses. Yuka. Yuka's house. Let's see what Yuka's house is all about. Yuka is sick? I'm very sick. Oh, she has coronavirus. We should mail her some medicine. I've never seen that before. She actually won't let us in the house because she's sick. Poor little thing. We need to give her some medicine. I'm a dermatologist. I can fix it. She probably just has a pimple. I can fix that. Whose house is this? Oh, they're not home. Stu's not home. McDuffie says, I have 69 subs. Yeah, <laughs> I have 69. It's the perfect number, isn't it? And I don't mean that ironically. I just think it's a good number. Boy, it's so hard to navigate these mannequins. I hope it's worth it. I hope you get your rocks exactly where you want them. I literally just followed you all over the hole. <laughs> all over the hole. Oh, that's a big fish. Let's get ready. Oh, it's a sea bass. <laughs> okay, I'm going to catch this one fish and then I'm going to head back to my island. Here, fishy fishy. Oh, I went the wrong way with it. Okay, maybe you'll catch the fish. Because my my lure went the wrong way. Is he gonna get it? Oh, he's going for yours, I see. Just a goby. Alright, well I'm gonna head back to my island. So thank you for letting me visit, Acorn. Thank you very much. And for the deer head. I'm so excited about that. You have no idea. Let's see. Let's. I, I don't know if I've looked at the passport. So-called gamer. Oh, you have the ostrich in your picture. That's funny. Oh, do you want me to take this bamboo? You want me to take it? Oh, you don't... No, I'm not going to take your money. You need the money. A birdhouse? I have a birdhouse. Thank you very much. I should try to customize it. Wait, maybe I don't know how to make the birdhouse. Let me check. I do know that one. Okay. So thanks. I'll leave this here for you. Oh, you don't need to give me 10,000 bells. I didn't really do anything. A freezer? Oh, sweet. I don't have a freezer. Okay, I'll leave you with your money. Oh, you have money? Okay, I guess if you insist, I'll take it. Thank you very much. And thanks. I'm All I really needed was that deer head. That's amazing. So if you see anything that I have that you want, I'll be happy to trade it or give it or do whatever. So I will see you on the next one. McDuffie has a pet deer. Her mom was killed when she was small. We feed her. We don't feed her anything but the charros on the charro tree. What's a charro tree? Am I saying that right? I don't know what kind of tree that is. I have to look this up. That sounds interesting. Isaiah Cooper. Hello, welcome back. I've seen you on here before. It's good to have you back. We've been having a good old time here. Chris Collins, have a great and rest of the stream, Doc. Glad to catch your live stream for a bit. Love your videos. Thanks, man. That means a lot. 
Oh, cherry. Cherry tree. That makes more sense. <laughs> I'd never heard of a charro tree before. Alright, I had one idea I wanted to check out real fast because I have not ever done it yet. I want to see if I can make this birdhouse look better. Oh, Dr. Scrunch says, can you visit me? Yeah, I could do that real quick. I got enough time. For a little bit more. And then maybe like 10, 10 15 minutes. <laughs> Charros don't grow on trees, says McDuffie. What is a charro? It sounds like a real thing. I'm assuming it's a real thing. I can customize the birdhouse. Oh, but it doesn't get real fancy. I probably would do this one. I think that one looks nice. Oh, I put my customizing things away. And you do the deer too, all right. Black, white, ivory. That one looks distressed or antiqued. I guess that's the term, right? Okay, are we... I don't know if we're friends on here, Dr. Scrunch, are we? We might be. Ah, a loach. Okay, we'll open up your island. I think we are friends, actually. So if you open it, I'll head on over to your place. We'll make it a quick visit. And then... I think, I think I've done everything that I needed to do here, so I'll head on to bed. What's up, Del? It's nighttime, you know, you don't really need to wear those glasses right now. But you do you, Dell. Charros. Cowboy beans is a traditional Mexican dish. That's what McDuffie told me. Nice! I thought it was a real thing. <laughs> I can see how those wouldn't grow on trees. I want to visit someone via online play. Okay, here we are, Dr. Scrunch's Island. A weem away? Is that the right island? I think I've been here before, haven't I? I'm pretty sure I've been to your island before. Oh man, I'm coming up on two hours. I gotta, I've gotta, i got to be done pretty soon, so we'll make this quick. Now I want to make some charros. I've got a I've got a picnic roast that I'm gonna cook in my Traeger tomorrow and make some pulled pork. I'm super excited for it. Oh wow, sorry, that sink is really loud. No, that's okay. I'm gonna to go to bed soon anyways. McDuffie, I'm sorry, but it makes me made you say, you say it like, char, charos? Are you sure about that? It has two R's in a row. Don't you normally roll the R's in Espanol? Maybe I don't. I don't know Espanol. Oh yeah, I remember Dr. Scrunch with the beef hat. <laughs> Oh, Mick, it makes you mad that I say Charles wrong? I'm sorry. I didn't know I was saying it wrong. I thought I was saying it right. Who 
Who is coming? Who's visiting? Oh, it's Ozzy. Ozzy is lonely trash. Oh, poor Ozzy. We need to give him a self-esteem boost. Charos, but I googled it and it says Charos. Huh. We learn something every day. I need to find a recipe for Charos. Duffy, it's fine. It's just a pet peeve. That's a very specific pet peeve. To be annoyed by the way people say cowboy beans. <laughs> it's. I mean, I have things that bother me too, so I can't judge. Oh, Ozzy, you have a nice baby shirt on. It has a little binky tucked in the front pocket, doesn't it? I'm getting sleepy. I gotta get to bed soon so I can wake up early and cook my pulled pork. Let's see, who are the villagers? Oh, he has Celia and Phoebe. Apple and Dom. Oh, hold on a second. This is gonna kill me if your turnip prices are high because your store's still open. He's got that bell that I just barely found. Let's see. What is the turnip price? 85? Well, that's double what I sold it for. So that's still better than what I would have done. What is this cup? A coffee cup? A mug. Yeah, I want a mug, actually. I think I want a couple of mugs. mugs on all the tables on my island. I'll give mugs to everybody. You get a mug. You get a mug. Everyone gets a mug. Can I buy the bugs? Come on. Come on, little guys. Just let me buy these mugs in bulk. Clearly gonna buy lots of mugs. Let me buy like 10 of them. How many mugs have I got? That's quite a few mugs. One more ought to do it. Okay, what do you want to show me, Dr. Scrunch? I got about 10 minutes. You can show me whatever you want to, and then I gotta run to bed. Oh, that's a creepy painting. What is that? Is that Flea from the Red Hot Chili Peppers? I'm down in the bottom right corner of your island right now, by the way, in case you're wondering where I ran off to. his rubber ducky floaty. That's super cool. I used to have one like that. Let's see, the dock is off to the right, so let's head over there. I want to fish from the dock. Oh, 
Oh, let's catch this one while I'm here. Google how to make charos, says McDuffie. I'm definitely going to do that, and then I'm going to make them for real. One of my MAs that used to work with me, she actually got fired for reasons that make me very sad. Well, here's a bottle over here, Scrunch. Do you want me to pick it up? I'll pick it up and give it to you. Um, anyway, she's El Salvadoran. She's from El Salvador. And she made Tinga. She made Tinga for us one day, and it was so good. Yeah, I don't have say over who gets fired and who gets hired. And it drove me nuts that the administration decided to get rid of her. Oh, I used a fish bait and all I caught was a mackerel? That was a disappointment. surgeon fish and my fishing pole is broken okay so I gotta find dr. scrunch and drop this little bottle off dr. scrunch where did you go Okay. Bridges. Where's the bridge? Left. Here's the bridge. Okay, I'm at the bridge. Oh, this is a cool little rock outcropping. This is way cool, actually. Sorry, I left the bridge. I'm back at the bridge. Come to the top. Okay. McDuffie says, what's your fruit and can I be mod? My fruit is apples. And in terms of being mod, I haven't made anybody a mod yet. I don't know if I will for quite a while. There, there we are. Okay. Ozzy's just chilling there. Very cool, very cool island. Well, I think I've got to get to bed. So, thanks, thanks everybody for joining in. And thanks, um, Acorn, for letting me visit and for giving me that sweet, sweet deer head. And thanks to Dr. Scrunch for letting me come over. It's been fun. I love doing this kind of stuff. And overall, just relaxing. So I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to say I think I'm gonna say good night for now so let's go back to my island if you like what you see and you're just joining us for the first time and you're not subscribed feel free to do that if you like it and you want to see more every like every comment every subscribe really helps and we'll make this place a fun place to be together I hope that you enjoy it as much as I do and Leave me some comments, some feedback, what I like, what you like, what I should do better, what you'd rather I do differently. And I will see you maybe. I may stream tomorrow. I may not stream tomorrow. Um, but I hope you have a great weekend either way. 
and stay safe out there. Don't forget to slip, slap, and slop. And Mirapafshin. <laughs>